Around the world, there are countless cities with incredible skylines. Some are futuristic, some iconic, some medieval, and some utterly bizarre. In this video, we will give you our top 10 most beautiful skylines in the world. Hey guys, and welcome back to the Geography Bible. I'm Sam, your narrator for the video. Now, this list is completely subjective. We've researched skylines across the world, and I've chosen the 10 that we think are the most beautiful. I have personally seen some of these skylines with my own two eyes, and personally vouch for how incredibly beautiful they are. If you agree or disagree, so, starting off with number 10, Vancouver. Known as one of the most livable cities in the world for over a decade, Canada's largest west coast metropolis features a distinct since it's much cheaper to film here than it is in the Big Apple. While the buildings themselves don't offer much in the way of aesthetics, it's their overwhelmingly beautiful surroundings that make this one of the prettiest skylines anywhere on earth. Snow-capped mountains, wildlife-filled waters, and lush forests frame the glass skyline. With the 62-storey Shangri-La Hotel being the tallest building in the city. Number 9. Seattle Set a bunch of architecturally distinct high-rises on a steep hill, add a space-age national landmark, then put a snow-capped Mount Rainier in the background and set it all on the shores of Puget Sound, and you will have one of the most breathtaking skylines not only in America, but in the world. Home to the TV show Frasier, I've always loved seeing this skyline. That iconic Space Needle building is just a thing of absolute beauty. It kind of looks like a UFO is landing on this amazing city. Number 8. Tokyo Tokyo is the largest city in the world. Because of its size and density, every corner in the capital of Japan appears to have its own skyline. Neon lighting and unique contemporary architecture is visible at every corner. This is one skyline that truly means business. Tokyo has over 20 structures that are over 200 meters in height. One of the most well-known is the Tokyo Tower, a communication and observation tower. This structure is the second tallest in Japan. Tokyo is a city that looks spectacular at night with a myriad of colours. Despite its incredible skyline, Tokyo is actually a city restricted by its structures. Unlike many other destinations in Asia, Tokyo can't build mega-tall towers due to the potential danger of earthquakes. It does, however, have the largest fleet of helicopters in the world, meaning you can view the existing structures in the most incredible way. Number 7. Doha Doha's skyline looks like something straight out of a science fiction movie. Doha's building's architecture is a bold and feat of ingenuity and good engineering, and the best place to see it all is from the water, preferably at sunset, when the promenade and buildings are lit and the sky over the teal waters of the Arabian Gulf turns different hues of orange. It is one of the most pristine and clean cities I have ever seen. Number 6. Moscow now, this one really surprised me. I had no idea Moscow's skyline and city was so beautiful. The majority of Europe's tallest buildings can be found in Moscow. The shape and design of these buildings is truly breathtaking, especially when you compare it to the backdrop of the city. Number 5. New York City It is pretty much impossible to make a video about the world's best skylines and not mention New York City. The Big Apple is defined by its iconic Manhattan skyline, a mesmerizing silhouette created by dozens of glimmering skyscrapers and easily recognized by almost anyone in the world. The crown jewel of New York City's skyline is the 102-story Empire State Building, which stood as the tallest building in the world until its completion in 1972. Now, it is the 37th tallest skyscraper. Currently, the tallest skyscraper in New York City is the 104-story One World Trade Center, which rises 51 meters above the sacred site where the original Twin Towers were destroyed in the 2001 terror attack. Number 4. Dubai. Emerging seemingly out of nowhere, Dubai is home to more skyscrapers taller than 250 meters than any other city on the planet. While the skyline is not so dense compared to most other cities on this list, like New York City or maybe Hong Kong, each building is an architectural marvel on its own. The Burj Khalifa is the world's tallest man-made structure with 163 floors, topping out at an incredible 585 meters. 
although the tip of its spire reaches 829 meters, which is over half a mile. Some of the other notable structures in this desert city are the world's tallest all-hotel building, plus the tallest all-residential building in the world, the 101-storey Marina's Princess Tower. Number 3. Singapore You have to see this skyline with your own two eyes to truly appreciate it. It is so surreal seeing the $5 billion Marina Bay Sands Hotel and Gardens by the Bay. This pristine city-state is by far one of, if not the most, archaeologically impressive places on the planet. When you see the Marina Bay Sands Hotel for the first time, your jaw will hit the floor. It is unbelievable how big it truly is. The cantilever on top with the infinity pool makes this one of the most iconic, if not the most iconic hotels on the planet, in my opinion. Number 2. Shanghai once known as the Paris of the East for its glamour and elegance, Shanghai is now one of the largest cities in the world with over 24 million inhabitants. The city is on track to become the world's largest financial centre and constantly adds new eye-popping skyscrapers to its ever-growing portfolio of amazing structures. The tallest building in its skyline is the 127th floor Shanghai Tower, which is 632 metres and makes it the second tallest building in the world. The most recognised, however, is the Oriental Pearl Tower, which has 11 spheres, a revolving restaurant, and an impressive light display at night. And finally, number one, Sydney, Australia, my favourite city in the world. I've dreamt of living here my entire life. I've visited Sydney four times in my life and seem to love it more and more each time I visit. Pretty much every night I'd walk down to the quayside and take in the beauty of the harbour and opera house looking over the skyline. The Sydney Opera House, in my opinion, is the most iconic building on earth. Ask anyone and they will know which city it is in. Watching the sunset go down over the harbour on a lovely 20 degrees night with a beer in your hand is pretty hard to beat. And finally, a few honourable mentions. Hong Kong, one of the best skylines in the world, but it's very, very dense and there are many uninspiring buildings. In terms of beauty, I don't think it makes this list. Chicago, for me, Chicago just misses out on the top 10. I've personally visited Chicago and been up the Willis Tower. It was absolutely incredible. Frankfurt, excluding Moscow, possibly the best skyline in Europe, sometimes referred to as the Manhattan of Europe. Kuala Lumpur, the Petronas Towers are a thing of absolute beauty. However, remove them and Kuala Lumpur's skyline isn't overly impressive. So there we have it, our top 10 most beautiful skylines in the world. Do you agree or do you disagree with our list? Let us know below, we'd love to hear your opinions. If you enjoyed the video,